Linda. <laughs> Linda, Linda. Linda, Linda, the late comer. I asked you to come here by 12, and you are just coming by 12.05. Sir, huh? I, I actually had, I, I had a lecture. <sighs> Students. Sit down, sit down. I don't have uh, much time. How are you? Fine, thank you, sir. Yeah, so how is school? How are the courses? Oh, 411. <laughs> I know that course. How is it? I'm trying my best. It's fine. That's good. That's good. Linda. Take a look at this. Okay. <laughs> ah! Oh my god. <laughs> so this is the best news I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> I can't even believe this. Oh, thank you God. Linda, you deserve this. Come on, have some faith in your abilities. So you don't understand. This has always been my dream. You've always excelled. So it's no surprise to me that you were offered this scholarship. Although um, you've been shortlisted for the master's program, okay, but you still need to maintain your GPA at 4.5 sure. because that's the minimum requirement. So remain focused, keep your head down, and finish strong. Okay? Of course, sir. I am focused. I mean, after this semester, I have just one semester left. And I can't even mess things up. My family actually depends on me. You know what, Linda? What you're doing right now, this is the right direction you're taking. Okay? So just keep your head down. Remain focused. It's been placed in you to make something of yourself. This opportunity is for you to make something out of yourself and to help your family. So I'll advise you one more time. Finish strong. Okay? How are you now? I'm fine, babe. Uh -uh. So you fine, finish. Are no, you no. serious? <laughs> this girl will find you worrying you. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, Jerry. But wait, though, babe. Hold on. Where have you been? It's been over two weeks now. I don't see you anywhere in school. I know they see you for lectures. What happened? Uh, I lost my cousin, uh, one of my cousins. Oh. So we had to travel to the village for the burial. Yeah, hey, uh, sorry, mm. but how? Car accident, yeah. Are you serious? Mm. Hey, uh, oh, you're a really strong person. Mm. I wonder what I would have done if I was in your shoe. No, it's just, I can't dwell on these things anymore. And I know she's in a better place. Mm. In fact, I want to go out and party tonight just to get my mind off it. Sandra, mm. this is your cousin that died. Yeah. Now he or now she? My cousin now, my cousin. The cousin that died. <laughs> eh. Anyway, sorry. Yeah. Eh? Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Sandra, Sandra. Mm -hmm. Fine girl. Yeah. Eh, sorry. Give me your uh, phone number. So <laughs> I'll call it's you. Good. My dear sister, it is the Lord's doing. <laughs> you don't know how happy I am. Have you told Monsi yet? Ah, no. I haven't told Monsi, but I will tell her. I will tell her, I'll tell her tomorrow. You know Monsi now, once I tell her, she will get over the moon. So I want to see her face to face and tell her. You don't know how happy I am. I am already seeing myself in UK like this. You don't even understand. Then I will now talk to the sister of someone who is in the UK. <laughs> what are you not saying? Eh, are you sure? A girl your age, 400 level, and you don't have a boyfriend. You should be ashamed of yourself. Ah, uh, please don't bring that boyfriend talk now. Uh. It's not as if you know, you're going to make this a habit. I just need you to go out and enjoy yourself. All right, no, Wala. I wasn't just sure, Jerry. So that's why I decided to call you and tell you about it. But since you said I should go for it, I, I will. I'm a new problem. 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 Oh, just so much of the family rule. Jaja, you bull. I'm a new problem. 
I know the music was loud. I'm sorry. Hi, ladies. That's a massive problem. That's a problem. That's a problem. That's a problem. That's a problem. 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 I'm a new problem. It may have to be a new problem. I'm a new problem. I'm a new problem. I'm a new problem. It may have to be a new problem. Go back to knowledge or go around to go sketch you. What is it? How far? Who is that girl? Hmm. Which one? I came with more than one. The one in the purple dress now. Linda, she's one of my girls. Mm -hmm. uh, she's my type, you know. Uh, <laughs> like this, you will never change. You that you're getting married in a few days. Ha, ha, you cannot change. No. Come on now, Alpha, talk to her for me now. Wait first. Why must they be one of my girls? When I came, you were touching and dancing some girls. Why can't you pick from those ones? Mm. No, mm. no, no, no. Mm. It is hard that I want. Go, 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 Another man food is another man poison. Go, monkey no fine, but wait, wait. If I do this for you, what's in it for me? Ah, uh, how about an hour for you? So now because of this girl, they do all this gra gra. But wait, is there any time that I have not settled you when you brought girls for me? This girl is actually a very difficult person. I'm not even sure if she'll be able to do these things. Uh, but you know what, I'll try. Thank you! Hey, hey, don't thank me yet, don't thank me. What? I hope I don't end up with a man like you. Come on. <laughs> You end up with a man ten times worse. Oh, fuck. Sorry. Uh, no. It's fine. You can use it. You sure? Yeah. One, one, one hundred percent. Yeah. It's all yours. Yeah. Samo, by the way. What's your name? Linda. Linda. What a lovely name. A good blogger, right? Linda. <laughs> Honestly, you seem like my type of girl. Linda. Hi, sorry. I thought you left me. Sorry. What are you doing talking to that guy? Well, he's a cool guy. Besides, he was inside there and we just got chatting. Mm. Mm. Guess what? What? Koladi wants to talk to you. So, what am I supposed to do with that information? Go upstairs, go to his room and talk to him. Yeah. Sandra, are you implying what I am thinking? And what are you thinking? Sandra, are you encouraging me to sleep with a man that is due to get married in a few days? Come on, Sandra. Don't insult me. I am not a prostitute. Will you shut up? Are you calling me a prostitute? Uh, I never said so. No, I mean, do I look like a prostitute? Wait. I, I can't believe that's how you see me. It's fine. I'm sorry. Oh my God. Yeah. 
I'm not asking you to go up there and sleep with the guy. You're a student, you're rounding up school. And these are people that are very important in this society. They can help you get a job in the future. I'm just trying to look out for you. Hey, come on now. Fine. What does he want to talk to me about? How am I supposed to know that one? Am I in his head? Please come and talk to me before you start giving me this. Your Sandra, I'm only doing this thing because of you. I know. <laughs> I know. But you will smile. This your face is strong. Why your smile is scary? <laughs> <laughs> I hope you're enjoying the party. It's cool, right? Have you had something to drink? I'm alright. Mm. Mm. Ah. Come on, let's loosen up a bit. <laughs> Life is for the living, isn't it? Haven't you had enough to drink? Mm. Ah. Yes, you're right. <coughs> I should be focused on you. Alright. I'm all yours, baby. Well, Sandra said you wanted to talk to me about something, so what's it about? Oh, yeah, um, you see, right from the moment you walked in through my door, you caught my eye. I like you. A lot. You can't be serious. You're getting married in a few days. Don't you have a conscience? Look, this is it's just going to be over. No, nobody has to know. Yes, I'm getting married and I'm going to be stuck with my wife for the rest of my life. I'm knocking the same woman forever. And the best I could do is have some fun with the most beautiful girl I have seen before then. Come on, man. You mean, all you know is luck. Must everything be about sex? Well, if you do, you should be happy you're going to have her the rest of your life and not act like it's some death sentence. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Look, I would make a damn good husband. I love my fiance. I just want to have fun tonight. As you can see, I am no broke nigger. I'll pay you for this. I'll pay you. Do I look like a prostitute? <laughs> Clearly you have no respect for me whatsoever. Excuse me. Look. <laughs> He's a celebrant for Christ's sake and everyone is out there for him. Him being away for too long doesn't seem right. Trust me. He'll be out in a minute or less. You just need to... Daddy! 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 Ah! Bitch! Stupid! Daddy! 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 Oh my god, what have I done? 
Jesus. Nobody's going anywhere. Who was in there with Kolade? Who killed Kolade? I swear to God, I don't, I don't know anything. I swear, I don't know anything about this. I swear. That's a lie. Ah, uh, you know about it now. Did I see you carry that girl Linda in there? Eh, no, Linda now. Call her. Pick up your. No, Linda. Call her. I don't want them to talk to her. And then I introduce them. I don't know what you are in the room. I beg that one. I'm sorry. No, we can't even go to police station now. I swear to God, I don't know what happened in there. I can't. I, can't, I don't know what happened inside. Like Shut up your mouth. You must say to say. When you get to the police station, you have an explanation to give. Please now tell them I'm innocent. Now they don't want to hurt you. I just came here to have fun. Eh, you don't baggage for this at all. Let, let me come and be going. Ah, you what stop you there. Come on, will you, will you go back? Ah. Because you have an explanation to give to. It's, it's, it's not necessary. She is the ringleader. Ah, wait now, wait. Girls, please stop everything and don't worry. Let me go. You choke my son. And that is how my life changed, just like that. Reputation ruined. I was branded a murderer. One thing Sandra didn't tell me was Kaladi was also the son of Abraham Badru, a well-known politician. As far as Nigeria was concerned, I took away a son, a friend, a husband-to-be, while I was just branded a bad girl. So keep your head down, remain focused, and finish strong. My mom has really suffered for I and my sister, and I really need to take her out of there. Sometimes, I feel I should have just let him have his way with me. I guess that would have been better than this mess I have gotten myself into. How I wish I could turn back the hands of time.